Every day we're feeling the impacts of inflation and that includes where you rent. Prices are climbing along with everything else. That's why an East Texas family is getting creative. They're drawing up plans for new affordable housing. Our Brennan Gurley introduces us to the Hanks family who's bringing the tiny home trend to East Texas. I can't think of a place in America that, that, that doesn't need something like this. D. Hanks and his three sons have a vision. They are turning recycled shipping containers into affordable housing. At some point when you're first starting out, you don't have 12, 1500 a month or more to, to, tr to try to rent something to have a place, you know, to have a place to lay your head at night. The tenants either have to sew an arm and a leg to be able to afford it, and it puts them in a position where they're one paycheck away from the house of cards folding. A recent report by TexasHousers.org found there are 900,000 extremely low income renter households in Texas. This equates to more than a fifth of all renter households in the state. The city of Tyler's housing advocate thinks the reconfigured boxes of steel are worth considering. If, if a family can find something that's, that's suitable and that's reasonable from a cost perspective, I think it'd be great to jump on that opportunity. Um, it is smaller, but again, uh, it's not something that, you know, you're looking at permanent, you know, especially if your family expands, uh, it'd be definitely something you want to look at transitioning from. But in the meantime, it, it kind of stops the bleed. The Hanks family gave us a tour of one of their shipping container homes. Inside, and you'll find all the comforts of home on a smaller scale. Tiny homes and minimal living and stuff like that, that's kind of the trendy thing now, and I think it's trendy out of a necessity. It's about a five-day process from the build until it's move-in ready. This is just a great cost-efficient solution to, a, to lower rent that just is not possible with conventional construction. I mean, it just doesn't exist. They offer four different designs, a duplex, luxury duplex, one bedroom, and two bedroom floor options. A 40-foot container provides 320 square feet of living space. I'd love to scale it nationwide. Our factory down in McAllen is making close to one complete house a day. This concept has been in the development stages for more than a year, and it didn't take long to generate interest in several states, including California, Maine, and Florida. There's a lot of different applications for these that we're seeing nationwide, and, and as this gets bigger and bigger, we, we're realizing we're gonna have to ramp up production pretty quickly. Three shipping container homes near Lake Palestine being rented out with all bills paid for as low as $700 per month. Plans are already underway to put container homes on on this land and true. The longevity on these should be really, really good with very little uh, repair, you know, repair or, or upkeep cost. In order to entice future tenants, the Hanks family is eliminating the traditional six and 12 month leases, instead offering month to month to those who are strapped for cash. As we notice the traditional credit check applications, background checks, all that stuff was, is eliminating who needs this the most. Thinking outside the box while changing the landscape for a community in need. For CBS 19, I'm Brennan Gurley. If you would like more information on container homes, you can find a link to this story on our website, cbs19.tv.